productivity but emissions that the control of uh, emission carbon footprint and all so we have so uh, it's one of the major corporate responsibility in this ESG issue then uh, one more in the half months back when we all functional directors were sitting in new delhi in one meeting and it was discussing what kind of changes are required in the organization for future uh, improvement and development what kind of changes we should do how transportation systems will be within sale and from sale to its customers how the environment will look like what kind of measures uh, <coughs> will be taken by the management feel like how do you foresee the future in 10 years time you will have about 45 minutes to an hour to deliberate and <coughs> then type it out i'm sure each group will have at least one day. from said from uh, uh, some four years back and enjoying happily with my grandchildren i have uh, deputy manager what what manager good afternoon i am deepak kumar senior manager computer and automation department yeah. we'll be just talking to you in a few minutes from uh, now about uh, 10 years ahead sale our company 10 years ahead but before that a short introduction of our bgm ct part Manoj Bosch, Senior Manager, Refractories. No, I am Sailesh Kumar, Manager, Safety. Uh, good afternoon, all. I am Arvind Yadav, Telecom Department. Rajiv Ranjan, SMS. Rahul Kaushik, Madhya. Do that because one thing I have realized that all the ten teams are, in whatever way they are presented, uh, their aspirations and dreams are in sync. So. Uh, He is in body, right? right? Can we have applause for all of them, for all the groups? Thank you. Uh, and as someone said, that in all the presentations, uh, what's coming out is that nobody has said that we are going to keep doing what we are doing now. So there is a yearning for change, and which brings us to the issue that probably yes, the decision to recraft the vision was probably a right decision.